the pronounce it. What's what's the shoe sauce? Don't know if that's pronounced properly or not. Let me know in the comments below. Tell me, would you believe, 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 think it's more lyrical? Cause every time I go somebody gotta see the manacle and every time I come I'm eating everything that's edible. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Moss. As you already know, I cook on this channel. But on this occasion, I'm not gonna be cooking, I'm gonna be making some drinks. It's as you can see behind me, we've got some Halloween themes going on. So most likely the drinks will be Halloween themed kind of thing. I don't know. Let's see how it goes. Stay tuned, don't go anywhere. Make sure you just subscribe to the channel, share, like, and comment. Shall we get started? Right guys, the first drink that I'm gonna be making is called Dalguana. What I'm gonna need is a cup. This is some uh, chocolate. And you just wanna Okay, just a little design kind of thing you wanna call it that. I've got some milk here, just pour it in. Okay, just up to about there. Or so or not. We're short a bit of milk, that's fine. We're gonna put this over to a side for now. Now we're gonna need some coffee. Put four maybe five spoons depending on how stingy you are I forgot count, I'm just going to leave that as that right. add some water ok and now we're going to whisk it or one of these things right That's quite messy. <laughs> That's fine. Okay, you just gotta be careful because it's gonna spill and yeah. <laughs> Can you guys see that? Okay, I'm gonna try and bring it up, but let's see how that goes. I'm gonna tip it out a little bit, see if that's gonna work. I'll be back in a sec. Right, so guys, since the other one was a bit too small, the other cup, I pour it into this one. I put three or four spoons in that, added some water, and now we're gonna try again. There we go. So, what this should do is you just wanna bring it up and down the motion wise and spin it around, and it makes a foam. Right, and I think that should be good enough because it's foamy enough. Right, now, you wanna bring the drink back and just put the foam gently so it doesn't sink in to the milk. Just to decorate it, I'm going to try, hopefully it doesn't sink. Some of these, I don't know if you can see, eyes, just pick it from on top. If it doesn't sink, yeah. Yeah, all over. Just like so. Put a few in. Good. Put one in the middle. Sorry. <laughs> Clearly I haven't done this before. <laughs> and here is uh, some sort of chocolate bar where you just want to put it on the side. Oh, that's going to sink and disappear. Right, I'm just going to put it up. Yeah. That's going to go in there, guys. There was a chocolate there, I promise you. <laughs> Jump that. That's the first one. Enjoy. Moving on. Okay, with a second drink, this is called chocolate martini. Now this is my version, you may do it different ways, I don't know, I'm gonna show you mine. So to begin with, this I'm gonna give it a little shake. You got your martini glass. You just wanna garnish it a little bit. Okay, 
are done. And I'm gonna put one of these chocolates in the base, put that to a side. You got a shaker, put some ice. Now, this is a measuring cup and all. I'm gonna put double shot of Bailey's. Okay, a full cup of this is a double shot. That goes in like so. Now, a single shot of martini, which is half a glass. Goes in like so. And now, put the lid on, put that on top, and hopefully it doesn't spill. Sprinkly stuff. Let me just make sure I get the right one. Um, see that. Some of these golden bits were just to make it look good. Job done. Chocolate martini, guys. So this one is going to be called uh, Bloody Mary. In this occasion, I'm going to be using uh, vodka. You can also use tequila if you prefer, but my preference is uh, vodka. What we need, again, is a shaker with some ice in there. And you've got some tomato juice. You want to pour it in. Save about there. Job done, right? Moving over. Now you're going to get the vodka. I'm going to put a double shot on this because uh, Singles were enough. There you go. So that's that. And now you want to move over to the hot sauce. Put a little dab. That's enough. And this is the what's what's the sure sauce? I don't know if that's pronounced properly or not. Let me know in the comments below. Couple of drops of that. Okay. And now, finally, time to shake it all up. And put it like that up there. Okay. And we're good. some of this lovely celery here, put a little bit of mint on the side, okay, and a couple of straws and all. That's your bloody mirror guys. And now with the final uh, drink that I'm going to be making is whiskey sour. This is my version, um, you can use other drinks with, with it as well, but this is the bad boy here. So. What you're going to need is, I've got a small cup, I'm just going to put one ice in there, okay? Put some whiskey in there, of course, that's enough. And then you've got some soda, and then I'm going to call it Sprite or whatever you call it. Okay, maybe a little bit more. Done. And now, Get some lime, squeeze it in. <laughs> yeah, that's about it. Done. Okay, I'm not 
too much of a go to detail with that. And then this as a decoration, you just want to put it on the side. Okay. You've got the lime skin, just squeeze it and try not to rip it like I did. There you are. That's fine. And that right there is your whiskey sour. Tell me, who you really, really, really think is more lyrical? Cause every time I go somebody gotta see the medical and every time I come